Okay, so welcome to class. Today I'm gonna go through because exam is Tuesday. So I'm gonna go through 2019 C set multiple choice questions. Most of these questions are repeated questions, so I am sure most of you know the answers, right? Okay, so the first question. The international governing body for cricket is the ICC. That's the answer. What is meant by the term para Olympic? It's competition for individual with disabilities. The main objective of physical education is to do what? Coach various sports elite level, provide knowledge for specific sports, improve physical fitness of an individual, or develop physical, mental, and social well-being. Good. Develop physical, mental, and social well-being. Which I'm following is the lowest level of organization in the human body? Is it a cell, organ, tissues, or system? It's a cell. Okay. The sheet of muscle lying below the lung is the diaphragm. Good. All right. This diagram shown here look at this diagram it says which of the labeled muscle is the abdominal muscle so abdominal muscle is right here so the answer is D which of the system send messages between the brain and the body it is a nervous system. Number eight. Which two bones meet at the patella joint? The patella is a knee joint. So it is the femur and the tibia. So the answer is C. Which I'm following is a function of the human circulatory system. Does it move bone? Does it transport nutrients? Transmit impulse? Or produces enzymes? Which one? It transports nutrients. Okay. Which are the foreign organs aid in the digestive system in breaking down and absorption of food? Does it pancreas does that? The gallbladder appendix. Which are the following organs aid the digestive system in the breaking down and absorption of food? Appendix is out, so it is pancreas and gallbladder. In humans, the biological name for the windpipe is everybody know that one, the trachea. Look at this diagram right here. Which bone is found in the vertebral column? Not this, no, no. So this is the answer. So answer is C. Number 30. A sprinter is asked to include weight training and plyometric in his or her workout. Which fitness component will this improve? Want to talk about weight training and plyometric? We're talking about power. So the answer is power, which is A. Select the correct sequence of activities associated with catching a high ball. Look at this question. It says, keep eye on the ball. Withdraw hand and cushion ball, catch a ball with thumb and finger pointing upward. Okay, so then the sequence is that you're going to keep your eye on the ball, which is one. Then you're going to catch the ball, and then you're going to 
drawer and in. So the answer is 1, 3, and 2, which is B. Number 15. Which of the following sports related fitness tests measures coordination? Is it alternate hand, wall throw, or standing broad jump? One hundred meter shuttle run or stroke stand? The answer is alternate hand wall throw. Okay, um, next question number 16. Which of the following are methods of training in sports? You have interval, circuit, and forklift. Which one would be the answer? All of them. All three are methods of training in sports. The multi fitness or the multi stage fitness test could be used to measure agility, coordination, reaction time, or cardiovascular endurance. The multi stage fitness test we're talking about. All right, the answer is cardiovascular. Endurance. Aerobics is a physical activity contributes best to endurance, flexibility, balance, agility. Aerobics has to do with the air, so it is long, so it is endurance. The ability to change direction quickly while moving relates to what? Everybody know that one? Agility. Yes, you're smart that one. Agility. <laughs> Which of the following are measures for doing warm-up exercises? Removing lactic acid, increasing joint flexibility, and cycling in the Alright, the answer here is remove lactic acid and increase joint flexibility. So it is 1 and 2, which is A. Which is 
rice. Which food nutrient is the best choice when attempting carbo loading before an activity? Carbo means carbohydrate. So what you carbohydrate? Fat, water, protein, or starch? Starch. Okay. So it is D. 29. The essential protein in the diet of human makes up 60% of body weight. So which essential nutrient in the diet of humans make up 60% of body weight? Is it the fat, water, protein, or carbohydrate? It is water. When a bone at a joint is forced out of its normal position, the condition is called what? Dislocation. <laughs> All right. A footballer needs increased protein intake when? When? So a footballer needs increased protein intake when? Weight training for hypertrophy. That's D. Which of the following is R used as a source of energy in the absence of carbohydrate and fat? Three of them go together. So you have protein, carbohydrate, and fat. So carbohydrate and fat. So then the next one is protein. So the answer is B. Governments can help to build community links through the provision of what? Providing sporting facilities, financial help for clubs, coaches, and other personnel. All three. So they are going to um, provide financial help for the clubs. They are going to build sporting facilities as well as help provide some coaches or expertise to help develop what is happening in the community. So it is D. The main reason why fewer girls than boys take part in sports is stereotyping. So it is B. You are a great umpire and you hear the ball of taunting the batsman. The best action to take is to do what? It is C. You're going to pull the ball aside and ask him to refrain from his discourse. Look at this diagram. Which region in the graph shows an athlete as his or her best performance? So they start lower, peak, right here, see? And then they go down. So the answer is B, C, which is C. Which of the following factors is or not consideration when organizing a sports program for young people? You should not look on their ethnic background. You're going to look on their skills, their size and weight, and age and gender. Ethnic background has nothing to do with organizing your program. Alright. A player is given a red card in a hockey match for a minor infringement. As a captain of the team, what should you do? Should you approach the umpire or the referee and demand a change in decision? Do nothing and continue to play? Encourage the rest of the team to play harder? Take the team and walk off the field. <laughs> that would be so stupid, right? So the answer is that you're going to encourage the rest of the team to play harder, which is C. Jack is physically challenged, but attends public school. During physical education session, the teacher should do what? Prevent Jack from participating? Allow Jack to go to the library? Have the other children made fun of Jack or adapt the lesson to include Jack? Shake it, shake it, all right? So it's D. Would you follow an action and include in his or her diet to prevent constipation? Fiber, fat, minerals, carbohydrate. Fiber. I'm a great man. All right. Would you follow is not an example of a display of sportsmanship. Accepting defeat, winning at all costs, respecting rules of the game, shaking the hands of your opponent. Listen, this is just a giveaway. Not 
this pair of sportsmanship. Winning at all costs. You can't kick on a person or knock on a person because the person wants to shoot the ball. Defend. Right? Under the, under the rules of the game. Good. So it's winning at all costs. That is the answer. Which one for them can be assessed via the internet? This means that what can you go on the internet and access? Um, Results of sporting activity. Hmm, the shape of the head. Details of sporting events and fixtures. Okay. Statistical information on sporting events. Okay. So the answer is all. So mm -hmm. all would be D. Which I call is not a reason why athletes competing in major games are randomly tested for jobs. The answer is to support research by water. Which is C. The cardiovascular fitness of an athlete could be measured by which one of these tests? You have sit up test, you have the catch boil test, you have the standing broad test, and you have the hand grip test. The answer is B. Alright. Number 45. When a company gives financial aid in return for having the name linked. To an individual team or sport, this is known as what? All of them know. Sponsor, all this is it's a sponsor, this and this sponsor. So it's sponsorship. Woo! So you all will get 100 on this paper, don't mm -hmm. Okay. So we're gonna go to another, to another paper. So, peace out.